So to say a mod is the most realistic mod I've played with in my entire life is a very, very big statement to say at the start of a video in a title. But I genuinely don't think you guys understand. Like this is the most realistic Sims 4 animation that I've seen in my entire life. Like it's really realistic and I don't know what to think about it. I'm not talking, this is just some big monstrous build I got off the gallery. I searched for bar and this is the first thing that I saw. It's labeled as a residential lot. Anyway, guys, this is a mod in question. You're probably thinking, Satch, on earth you on about the most realistic mod, a bloody pool table. I've seen some other people play with this mod on TikTok and I really wanted to give it a go. So it's literally just a pool table. Also, I want to say it comes with like loads of really nice swatches. I personally think it looks Maxis match. You may disagree. I personally think this is very Maxis matchy looking. It suits the vibe. Do you know what I mean. So today, Shanice Shanice is joined by Goth Shanice. <laughs> today, Shanice and Goth Shanice are going to be playing pool together, which is amazing. I wonder who's going to win. Now, apparently also this is like the longest, not only the most realistic, apparently this is the longest Sims animation of all time, like longest Sims were animation. So, oh gosh, not bloody Judith Ward. She's not playing pool with us. No, she's not. Shanice Shanice and Gothic Shanice, they're going to be playing pool. Now, we have to play this in speed one because the animation takes so long and like you really have to just like appreciate how intense this actually is. So if we look right now like she's putting a hand on the table getting the balls out they're having a little chat whilst they're doing it and it's just like the way she's moving her hands like guys I th it really is like it sounds like such a weird small thing to say but like this is so realistic like it's she's literally getting each individual ball out and she's pulling them in separately like if this was like a, an EA thing, they all would have just magically appeared, but she's actually taking out every single individual ball. Gothic Shanice is running her hand along the table. She's literally setting it all up properly. Like it's literally insane. I just can't believe, like, like she's just swiveling it a little bit. Like this is really long. I can't, like it's, she literally handed the thing over. She's popping it in there. No guys, I know I'm getting excited. Welcome, I can stop ruining the moment. I know guys, I know I'm getting excited over such a little thing. Thing. Okay, look, she's pushing it, the ball. I don't know what it's called. Look, and the actual balls are moving around in a set direction. Oh, she potted a yellow one, lovely. But she's doing it again. And even Gothic Shanice is like watching the ball. Like they're both, it's so like precise, the animation. Like I've never seen a Sims 4 animation <laughs> this precise. Is, is oh, Gothic Shanice potted a red ball? There we go. I wonder who's, I wonder if it's gonna tell us who's gonna win or if I'm just gonna have to guess because I do not know the rules of pool, but I'm just making it up so I go along. Guys, can we just like address like how, oh, I think Gothic Shanice won. She did. Gothic Shanice is the winner. Congratulations, Gothic Shanice. And Shanice, oh look, and they're just, look, they're literally putting the other balls back in the thing. Guys, it's literally so cool. Like it's literally amazing. Like, and they're literally going through it all properly. Are they done? Are they done? Or are they having, are they having a round two? I think, yes, they're done. Okay. Oh no, they're not done. What's she doing now, Shanice? Is she, I don't know what they're doing. Are they done? If I let go here, will she move away? Because apparently the animation for this, guys, is so long that you have to click reset game if you want them to stop playing just because the animation is so long. So it looks like they're finished. If I click reset the game, will they will they move? Will they leave? Are they stuck? What's going to happen? I don't know. There we go. They Guys, like, I know it's such a random little thing. <laughs> it's such a small thing to be talking about. But don't you guys? I think it's like, imagine if all Sims animations were this realistic. I think a lot of Simmers would be so happy. Do you know what I mean? They're going to be playing it again. Shanice, no, like, look at her take out the balls. Shanice, you've got, like, look, she's picking the balls up in her hand. She's got balls in her hands and she's putting the balls on the, in the triangle thing. I don't know anything about pool, so don't ask me what it's all called. But even the way the balls move, like, guys, let's be, if this was, like, an official thing, the balls would, she would have gone and the balls would have, like, magically popped. I just think like, do you guys really think that this is necessary or do you think it's a bit dramatic? I honestly think it's necessary. Like, I feel like I'm slowly turning to the dark side with like Alpha CC and stuff like liking the realism. Like, I just I just love all the realism. Do you know what I mean? This is absolutely perfect. I wonder if the game will be exactly the same as the previous game. Like, is Gothic Shanice gonna win again? Do you know what I mean? Like, is, is it gonna be, I don't know, 
if there's a random loadout. I know this does raise up your fun need and your social need when you do it, which is obviously always good. Who is actually gonna win? I don't know. Is she gonna win again? I feel like she's gonna win again. Yeah. So it seems like it's a fixed animation. So like, I guess that's the thing when it's so realistic. There's no, like, there's no gambling. There's no chance, like, one will win, one will lose. It's like the same every single time, just depending on where they're stood. But still, like, even the way she moves her arms and her bodies, I've never seen anything like this <laughs> Sims 4. Guys, why am I creaming myself over pool? I don't know about anybody else, but like when I play pool in real life, I can't even use the sticks. I have to use my hand and just like shove the ball with my hand because I, I don't know how to use these sticks because it's literally so hard. Oh, Shanice is feeling flirty with gothic Shanice. Uh, Shanice, she's basically your estranged sister. She's like your alter ego. You should not be flirting with her. Oh, oh, she teleported behind me. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> I don't know if that's anything to do with the mod. I feel like it's not because we've already finished playing pool. I think Gothic Shanice has teleported because she's absolutely mental. <laughs> now guys, on a bit of a tangent, like I just love Shanice Shanice and Gothic Shanice together. Like, don't you think it's so cute? She's literally such a cutie. Oh my God, I love Gothic Shanice. I think slightly more than the real Shanice. That's a little bit controversial, I know. And I've made them swap roles now. So this time, technically, normal Shanice, Shanice could, she should win, and then Gothic Shanice is gonna lose. But like the other guys, I can't believe it. Like usually when I play mods, they don't even bother to animate in like facial expressions or anything. But look at her leaning over the table and sticking her bum out. Oh my God, Shanice, you have such a snatched waist, Jesus Christ. I think she's been wearing a corset or something. Shani, like guys, I just can't believe it. And then if we click reset the game, there we go, it stops because the animation is so long. They basically give you the option to like reset it so you can stop them from doing it because it really does take a long time just in case you want them to stop. I just feel like guys, this is so cool. I feel like I want to keep this in my game and use it in bars. The closest possible thing we have to this is the Discover University ping pong table where you can play ping pong. I feel like we do need pool in The Sims 4 normal do you know what I mean? I just feel like we like we really need a pool table. People have been asking for so long and I'm sure we've had them in every Sims game. Everything Sims want, EA's just like, no, you're not getting it. You're not getting it. <laughs> I don't know why, but we don't get anything. But this makes me feel like I'm on a pool table in The Sims 4 so that like modders can, not modders, console players can access it too. Maybe they could even do a little arcade kit. Who knows? But that would be very, very fun. I don't know what you guys think about that. So today's video was so random. I can't believe believe I spent like 10 minutes playing with a pool table in The Sims 4. That was honestly so much fun. I haven't had that much fun with a little activity object in ages. Modders do pick up the slack. Yes, they do. And they do an excellent job. I know you guys are going to yell at me if I don't link to the mod. Where's the link? Where's the link? It's called Functional Pool Table in The Sims 4 Billy Art Mod by Utopia underscore CC. Oh, I've played an older version of the mod. There's a newer one, like 0.2. There's a, oh my God, there's a second version and they've added multiple new animations. Oh my God, I played the old one. Even the old one is good. So the new one is probably gonna be even better. So make sure you actually play the newer one. Billiard mod A0.2, the better one, the one that I didn't play with. By the way, if you guys wanna see my favorite mods of all time, then make sure you check out this video recommended. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next video.